Okay, welcome back to you some people. It's a quick video showing uh, the various uh, livery automation script that simply just applies our livery um, for our clients now. Um, and what you can do is you can actually even have random forms of delivery in terms of um, if you want to randomize delivery where it can apply a random delivery if you know the IDs you can basically do that um, of course in most airlines you won't be doing that you'll be mainly wanting to apply your own delivery um, but for you know places like uh, yeast and flight school etc just having random deliveries of um, some clients or whatever is um, what I usually will do so I'm going to free for this plane because it can't, this specific plane when it's in here um, that hasn't been spawned in can't be deleted so right now that's deleted we're going to spawn in one plane so there's blue wings that's blue wings there and see how much it can randomize for us. Calm winds. Might as well. I should have done a, a close up of deliveries actually. Now, this, I think Calm winds is a defunct airline, but they did have a good delivery. Let's see what else can we fish out. Oh. Oh, who? Yeah. Oh, another nice airline. I don't believe they are running there. I think they're defunct. Yeah. I do like that delivery. It's very Hawaiian, exotic. Let's delete that and see what else we can fish out. Oh, um, go for it again. Pretty sure we have a bit more. Huh? Hello. Hello my lovely. There's cat on. We can spank in in the delivery. Uh, that's cat I think we do have a very oh uh, there is one really exotic one. There we go, that's the exotic one I wanted to see. It reminds me a bit of Donald Trump's airplane. Now of course there's the bits and pieces here that um the uh, clients will just if they, you know, they see this red bit here, where this white bit is here, it's not part of the delivery. So all they can do is individually just recolor that small bit and the top bit here. And it will be nice and fresh. But as you can see, I, I like this delivery a lot. Because um, it's just so exotic. It makes, it makes the A350 look so, so different. Because um, the, uh, even the eyeliner blends blends in with the um, the black and the A350 island is so defining but with that livery it's really nice that's one and I think we do have we should have two more uh, that's blue wings again I might as well do a close off of blue wings since I did them before um, let's see Let's see how much it will take to find all of them. I think there's only two more left. There we go, that's Qatar. Go fair. Aeroblock CR. There we go, that's my favourite. Uh, wait, did I say it's my favourite? Yeah, and this is this is also one of my favorites. Actually, I'll be honest, um, because it's just so simple, and it looks effective. Um, I think Air Production would be the last one now, uh, because I only put a small bit, some poor deliveries here. Um, so anyone that's confused, there are black stuff on these deliveries, but um, most of the people who have, you know, who have done their deliveries will not have any of the black stuff. And if you find any black stuff on your delivery, do let me know. It's mostly just how um, when you import a PNG to Roblox, there's usually a 90% chance it will come out black. So what um, you can do is if you contact um, either Jordan or even myself, um, 
or even if you're skilled, all you have to do, because most of this black bit you'll see is on the wing texture part, um, and that's because of the transparency, so anywhere that's not filled, Roblox fills with black most of the time, so all you need to do is fill in the transparent bit with the color you want the plane to show, so in most cases it's white, and you're done. So that's pretty much all the deliveries there. Um, so whenever we make whole updates, you now have the interior video that will show you how to just move your interior like very quickly with just a small command um, bar command. And then you've got this delivery script now where you just put the IDs of your plane inside there and it will automatically apply for you. And it will delete the script after. Um, so that there's no clogging. So pretty much done. Thanks.